Discretion advised. Hello. I'm Brent Brennan Walsh. And I've discovered a sport unknown to the world. Extreme brooming. Let's take a look. What is it called? Um, well, like, that was the thing, me and Garrett, like, when we first, like, decided to come up with the sport, we were really bored, so, like, our minds, we couldn't really think of anything creative, so we just did extreme brooming. Um, it is called extreme brooming. Um, great fun. You know, it's a new sport. Oh, I would come. Great. Do you have any hookups or sponsors at this time? Yeah, me and uh, Garrett, we're trying to get sponsored by uh, the 99 Cent Store because they got some dope-ass brooms in there, man. Like, some of the stuff in there is, like, legit. Like, they're selling their brooms for, like, five bucks a broom, though, so we can't really, can't really afford it. Can't right? jump on it too fast. Yeah, so we're trying to get sponsored and take some price off that. What is your signature trick? <sighs> My signature trick. Got a lot of them. Um, probably my signature trick is the 360 scream. That's a good one. My signature trick, um, it's called the Hayward Broom Crosser. Um, it's a pretty legit trick. It's not. Um, I'm the only one that can actually do it right. Do people ever ask you why? Why do the sport? Yes, yeah, so a lot of people ask me why. My response to that: Why not? Is this sport addicting? You know, people say that uh, extreme brooming is ten times more addictive than heroin. Does I, I believe that. Well, you know, I, I do it every day. Can't live without it. You tell me if that's addiction, America. Do you have any inspirations? And if so, what? Um, yeah, Madonna, you know, she started a new trend. You know, so could I. I start a new trend. Hey, I, I started this. Dude, I was there! Leopard skins. Why leopard skins? Just say it to yourself. Leopard skins. It's just... It's good. It does it. make sense. Okay. So what you got right here is your uh, broom. This broom right here is made out of pure whale bone. Is that illegal whale bone? Yeah. Whale bone? This is horse's hair. Whoa. Baby horse's hair. Uh, they had to kill the bit, um, horse to get this. And this is plastic from Penguin Beak. So are you telling me this is pretty illegal sport? Um, yeah. All right, so basically here's what you do. You start out like this, uh, Garrett, put your focus on. Um, I'm already warmed up and everything, that's what Garrett's doing. So you're gonna get like this. And here's how you start until you build up all your speed. You can push on both sides to get your speed. Once you're gonna wanna start turning yourself, you're gonna get this hand right here. Push down like that, turn yourself. Yeah. See how I'm doing that? Yeah. And then to rotate sides, yeah. you bring it up. Now, what happens if you like miss uh, your hand or like wob See, wobble? See, that's what happens. Uh, a lot of times these bad boys will get speed wobble. You, that's, those are the kind thing. of things you can't. Uh... It separates the men from the boys. <laughs> Whoa, wipe out! <laughs> Keep it up. How did Garrett get involved? Took the kid under my wing a couple days ago. I saw him walking around with a skateboard and a broom. And I'm like, hey, you want to learn something? Took him down. He's, and he was the kid was legit, man. He was too legit. Too legit to quit. But, you know, I have to keep training him because I don't want to be unlegit. Because I don't have to make him quit. What's your sweep count, Garrett? Point nine six out! Nice. Good job. Do you ever get scared doing this sport. No. Do you have fears? You know, Buddha once said that, that it's good to have fear. Well, I say F you, Buddha. Whoa! He's the f***ing bad. How do you build up speed? You know, I have a little saying that goes, if you never slow down, you never have to speed up. Well, you know, we've done a lot of research, a lot of research, on how to build up speed, and 
how we go to speed is we go downhill. I mean, yeah. I don't know the exact number. It's it's like three times as fast going downhill than uphill. Three up times, <laughs> not plus, but times. Whenever I see a really dirty mess, I just have to clean it up.